Hey everybody. So uh, I got the walls done. I got all the plaster taken care of. I got the ceiling. Um, I got the ceiling painted. I got all the plaster secured. I got everything up. I got paint on. I went through and I'm working on stripping off the old wood. And uh, but my main project is the floor, and it is a bit of a challenge. And it's a slow go, but I will uh, give you some advice. So, yeah, stay tuned. I peeled up all of my carpet and I found this lovely underlayment completely glued to the old surface. But it's not all lost because what I found was awesome looking oak floors. Now, what somebody was really aw terrible, frankly, and did is I'm like, oh, this looks so good right here. This looks great. And then I get over to here and realize they didn't sand this. They belt sanded that. And it's gonna make life a little bit harder. So I went to the Home Depot and I bought a floor scraper. Nice long handle. Works, but doesn't work great. And it really, really is a slow go and it sucks. Not enjoying it. Not at all. So then I got this guy. Handy little paint scraper. Think, you know what? Maybe it'll work to remove this stuff because uh, this padding is rock hard. This, no, didn't work. Uh, tried a few different things, putty knives, everything else. And what I ended up finding was ye old heat gun that I've got over here. This is just a standard run of the mill, Harbor Freight, probably burn your house down if you don't pay attention to it, uh, heat gun. And what I'm doing is going like this. Now you can see where I'm working and you chisel it. You know what? You can make some progress slowly very slowly but with the addition of said heat gun you put the thing on high and you just let it run almost to the point where it starts turning the underlayment almost a different a little bit of a color and you probably can't see it in the video so you get right up in there you come in with your five in one scraper and it just peels right off this is the fastest way that I have found and it is incredibly slow incredibly slow but thankfully this is a small house so we're gonna get there guys yeah